Welcome to Supreme Family Garden. Guys, it is a pleasure, as always, visiting each and every one of you. Today, we are going to talk about growing your lettuce. I, Supreme, have found the easiest way to grow you guys' lettuce. When I say easy, I definitely mean easy. I mean my grandma could grow it. Easy, all right? Right here, guys. Actually, I'll give you this one. This is a small container. Now, this would actually grow enough for one person. Give or take. Give or take. Now, vegans, salad eaters, I want you guys to pay attention to this video. All right? We grew this. Well, she grew this. She didn't want to listen to me. All right? She grew this. And this is about a month, give or take. Okay. And in one of her other videos, she's showing you guys this. Now, again, it is warm right now when but to grow lettuce. All right? But some people can't. Okay? And this is your basic um, raised bed soil that my... Lovely know, wife. My lovely wife loves to use and she's just starting to grow and i was a little hard-headed yeah she's a novice so we're gonna overlook it now i'm gonna take you guys and show you how supreme grows his lettuce and all this consists of is one thing stay tuned guys all right guys now look we grew this lettuce same time she was over there in her area, and I came over here. Not only, guys, is this lettuce beautiful, it tastes delicious, too, okay? Just plop it off. See, this is real lettuce. Real deal. It's clean. It's very clean. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. Drum rolls, please. This is miracle Grow. Nope, not in the yellow and green bag and the black bag, okay? Black, like me, and gold, say it with me. Black like Supreme, gold like gold, all right? Black and gold bag. <coughs> <coughs> Ooh, <laughs> that just went down the wrong windpipe. <coughs> now look at this. And we've picked from this several times already. Now look at this, guys. No extra fertilizer, guys. Nothing. Nothing. <clears throat> Not only is this doing its thing with the lettuce, this is a guava plant that I got, as you guys seen in a previous video, for my birthday last July. Okay, we kept it indoors and we just brought it out and threw it in a pot. So when it does get cold, I'll put it in there. <coughs> <coughs> now that's your... <coughs> lettuce went in the wrong spot, guys. All right, bring the camera hunt, please. Now, what I'm going to do, all right, because we got to harvest some of this in here. Oh, here's a little loquat seed growing. Look at that. Oh, that's so good. Uh-huh. Actually, two. Hmm. Even better, guys. Get to show you a lot. All right, now what I'm going to do here, I'm going to pull this baby up and let you guys see the root system. Let me knock off some of my good dirt. I don't want to, I don't want to waste that there. Put that back, stuff's expensive. Okay, look at this. All right. Isn't that something? They were clustered up together. See, I should have thinned them. Yeah, but we didn't expect them to go yeah, back there. Yeah, we sure didn't. No, I didn't expect because you didn't. Well, you said your stuff was better than mine. No, I just said I was trying my thing. Okay. See, and ladies, when your husband tell you something, listen to the fella. Sometimes. Sometimes we kind of know, not all the time, not all the time, not all the time, know what we're doing. Yes, I admit, I should have listened on this lettuce mm -hmm. deal. Isn't that something special? And look how clean the leaves are, too. Mm -hmm. See, this is the things that we want to feed our families. 
not that stuff in their supermarket. Now, if you guys can, and you go out and buy yourself some lettuce, and you grow some lettuce, do yourself a comparison for your own self, you know? So that way you too can know and grow your greens just as well as Supreme. I said it like a metered rhyme, grow your greens like Supreme. You guys got that, right? The they metered got rhyme. Mars. That's right. Now look at this. I'm gonna lay this right here, baby. I'm gonna eat that night. Oh, you the guava become... tree looks nice. It does. But now look at this. What's that? Tomato? This is a tomato plant. Now, that. guys, this is one bag of miracle Grow Organics. Oh. Now, look at the stalk on this one here. No, right there. Yeah, there you go, right there with the finger. Yeah. It smells clean, too. You smell it? Yeah. Oh, you the one. I was wondering where all the dirt came from. Well, I just pulled the yeah. stuff out there. The guava looks amazing. Mm -hmm. The greens look amazing. Yeah. And again, folks. This was no. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Something else? Yes, it is. What's in there? That's another tomato plant. Look at that. Oh, it sure is. Look at that fly. I know he got a headache if he make it. <laughs> but isn't that something, folks? So what we're gonna do, like with all of our other greens, and you guys should too. I know I'm sweating like. Yeah, it's hot today. Somebody. Uh, I was gonna say something, but I'm gonna keep it to myself. Let these grow the seeds because they're going to go to bolting out. And then we'll harvest our seeds and then we're going to grow them again next year. So then we know 100% our seeds are organic. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching uh, Supreme Family Garden. If you like the video, again, we greatly appreciate it. If you guys give us a thumbs up, share the video with some of your family members and some of your friends and anyone that you think may have a niche to want to start gardening. Any questions, please leave them in the comments below. One of us will definitely get back to you. And as always, may God bless each and every one of you. Grow something, because I think from watching the news last week, we're going to make God mad, and then he's going to want to come back. I don't want God to come back. So I'm trying to do the best that I can, so that way God will give us... No, not that you don't want him to come back. Not, not right yet. Not right now. Yeah, I don't want him to come back, baby. No, you want him to come no, back eventually. Come back. He, no, I know I don't. Not, no, 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 I don't want that to happen. Why would I want the baby? No. That means we did wrong things if God come back. That's what somebody told me now. No, it's written in the Bible. Baby. What is it? Well, anyway, we're not going to talk Bible talk. This is about lettuce. Well, it is, but it's the same because God told me to grow this lettuce in this soil. So we're going to talk about the Lord. We'll talk about that tonight in the bed when we go to sleep. But anyway, folks, you make him happy, he won't have to come back. Because I know if y'all watching the video... You have somebody that you love who you're trying to grow something for. Y'all don't want God to come back either. You want him to be happy. Because God messing around and get mad. It's going to be some stuff. And I don't want him to come here. Y'all who want him to come back and y'all do wrong, y'all let him go to y'all house and punish y'all. He don't need to come over here to my house. That's right. We trying he to... can come here and bless us. There well, you yeah, go. you can come and bless. But mm -mm, they say in the Bible, if God come back, that means you did something wrong. Something like that now. No, no, no. That's my okay. quote. Paul had his opinion and I gave mine. God bless y'all. Thanks for watching.